Today, I want to introduce you to a new multiplication algorithm. It's extremely fast, it's very efficient, and it's easy to understand. Let's say you want to multiply two large numbers, and for now, let's assume they have an equal number of digits. This is a bit technical, but note that a digit here is somewhat of a loose concept. It could either be a single decimal digit, as in the rest of the slideshow, or it could be a hundred digits, or it could be a megabyte's worth of digits. Um, the actual unit for digit will depend on the implementation. So if you have, for example, a hundred digits, and you want to multiply that, you could split it up into 20 um, digits, where each digit has five decimal digits, for example. Let's proceed. Let's uh, multiply these two numbers. Big numbers, each of them have 11 digits. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 2, 3, 4 is the first number, and the second one, 8, 7, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 8, 7, 6. This means that the answer will at most have 22 digits. Now we multiply these by first creating a pyramid. Um, and on top of the base, we write out these two numbers. But we write them out in a manner that each of the digits occupy two digits worth of space. Okay, So we write it out like this. There's the first number, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 2, 3, 4. The second number and note that each of these digits occupy two digits worth of space and then we start by constructing the pyramid this is the base of the pyramid and the base contains the product of those two numbers the first entry in the base or the first block in the base contains three times eight it's 24 we write it out so that each digit uh, is in its place 4 times 7, 28, 5 times 4, 20, and so on. That's how we construct the base of this pyramid. Now, <coughs> we construct the pyramid row by row. Each row in the pyramid contains two products. For example, here, the first row, we put in two products, the product of the numbers, or the digits of the two numbers multiplied spaced one apart. So you have 3 times 7, 21 and next I have 8 times 4 which is 32 now go to the next block and here it's 4 times 4 is 16 7 times 5 35 go to the next block 5 times 5 is 25 4 times 6 is 24 and so on so I construct the whole row next I go to the next row and um, yeah I just review how that row was constructed but for the next row, I space the multiplication uh, out a bit more. Okay, in this case, it's two apart, no longer just one. And I have three times four is twelve, and eight times five is forty. For this block, I take uh, four times five is twenty, and seven times six is forty-two, and so on. So I construct the full pyramid. Here you can see the full pyramid. So, for example, at this block, I have uh, 6 and 72. You will see that this block is in the middle of 3 and 8 and um, uh, 9 and 2. So, 3 times 2 gives me 6, and 8 times 9 gives me 72. Likewise, each of these blocks is exactly in the middle of the two digits that we multiply. Finally, when you get to the top of the pyramid, we multiply that out to digits. 3 times 6 gives me 18, and 8 times 4 gives me 32 for this top row and the final block of the pyramid. Now, all I have to do is add up or sum all the digits in each corner. That will create carry, and I'll show you how to, how to deal with the carry, just like normally. Like a normal carry, we will will do it. Start with a 4 there. It just becomes a 4 in the answer space. No carry. Carry of 0. Then I add up the next column. 2 plus 8 is 10. And 8 is 18. So I write the 18 like that. There's the 8 and the 1 carry. It's written over there. Next column. 1 plus 1 is 2. And 2 is 4. And 2 is 6. And 2 is 8. 
plus the carry is 9 and 0 carry for the next column. Continue this in this fashion, add up all of these columns, all the digits in the columns, put the carry in the next column where it will be added uh, to that column until I have added up all of the columns. And that's the answer. There I have my answer 3023173777 7892798502984 huge number that I could calculate by constructing this pyramid and just doing single digit uh, multiplications and mostly single digit additions this uh, slideshow as well as more information is available at this uh, website www.feathersolutions.com slash multiply you can also send comments to multiply at feathersolutions.com thanks for watching